What's up, y'all? It is Derek. We are on the food boat. I need to make this bed. God, I'm disgusting. Um, let's just briefly make it real quick, just to make it look like it's made, right? So it doesn't look so terrible. We'll climb up in there. I ain't giving none of y'all a booty shot, so I'll climb up in there in a little bit. But, um, yeah, the uh, smoker out there where the dog's itching himself. Good morning, y'all. The smoker is not working just yet, so... I need to go out there and work on it. I um, don't know what it's got going on. So we'll figure this out together. Um, I'll describe it to you because some of y'all are smarter than me and you might know it. And uh, I, I don't know, make my life easier for me. I turn it on. I could hear gas, a little bit of gas, not a lot of gas. I can't smell the gas, but I hear a little bit of gas. And then I have, um, what do you call it? The ignition, the igniter switch will spark. So I have a spark, but I can't get a flame. So throwing this out there if any of y'all know let me know um got the notification this time who we got in here we got burned in here we got harvey viper i mean mike in here tiger in here um food bus in the house ash too ash got the notification good glad to hear you got the notification has anyone seen Teresa? some of y'all might need to wake her up are you still sleeping over there in texas Teresa? Just kidding, Teresa. I see you in here. Good to see you, Raymond. Um, who else we got? Let me check out the chat real quick before we go outside. But yeah, so the smoker is giving me issues. It won't light. Speaking of light, y'all can't see me when I step back here. Uh, that camera only has focus up here. Then I go back here, and you can't see me. And now I'm getting... Mariner all riled up. Come on there. Huh? We got to go to Lowe's today. <laughs> Come on. Start jumping. I'll help you. Huh? We got to go to Lowe's today and get a ramp for Mariner right here. I'm going to put a probably a one by 10 by six. Dad put some hinges in there and it'll give Mariner a chance to, to get a run and start to get up on the bed, huh? Oh, 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 oh. Oh. But, um, but yeah. So, what do we got? Who else we got in here? We got Captain Brian in here. Good to see you. Jets flying by. I can't hear you. All right. So, yeah, nobody's. Nobody's seen her yet. So let's come on outside. I'm gonna bring the phone with me so I can see the chat. Come on, man. I know I just got you up in the bed, but now it's time to get down. We gotta build that ramp, huh? We gotta build that ramp. This guy out here, I wanna be able to start smoking stuff again. And uh, I need that. What's up, man? The mayor's like, camera's out. Let's do some shit. Pretty much sure that's what everyone in chat is saying, too. But, mayor, unfortunately, unfortunately, it's a work day, dude. We got to work, man. We got to get this thing working. Oh, he's got a scratch. He's got an itch. Oh. Huh? You good boy? What? 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 Huh? Uh, come on. Let's. Let, this is what I gotta work on, man. I gotta work on this thing. Are you gonna fix it? Are you? <laughs> oh. 
Oh, 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 he's ready to wrestle, huh? He's ready to wrestle. I got you. Ah! You pinched me on that one. You pinched me. <laughs> Let's get the uh, stuff out of here. And by stuff, I mean the hardware. Because what I think I'm going to have to do is turn it on its side. It also needs a nice, good cleaning. That could, all, that could be what it is. is that port could just be really, really dirty. Oh, man. You think that's what it is? You just think it's dirty? Could be. You want to turn it upside down? Huh? What? Why you got to have so much attention today, huh? Why you got to have so much attention today? He's just like... Pay attention to me, not the camera. You got some dander going on. We got to get the Furminator on you. Watch yourself, watch yourself. Watch yourself. It's a Phillips head. Annie's out. Good to see you, Annie. Lack of propane. I had it hooked up. It's definitely not getting enough propane, but I don't know why. I don't know if there's something clogging it or what. But I've got to get it sorted soon because I've got chicken bacon ranch that needs to get smoked. It really needs to get smoked today. So if it doesn't get smoked in this smoker, I'm probably gonna have to buy another one or I gotta throw that chicken bacon ranch out and I don't wanna do that. What's holding those on? Is there a nut? It's a threaded port, okay. Maybe y'all yeah, get a better view if I put you up here. I'll bring the camera down a little. Don't fall in the mud, please. Don't fall in the mud. Maybe you get a better view if I put you up there, though. Open, it's just a port that needs to be cleaned. But I know y'all are just as eager as I am to get me smoking on the boat again and making food. I'm like dying to film an episode cooking with y'all. So, let's see if I can get that for y'all today. Is that it? That's this. wire or something to punch that thing gotta get smoking yep pro tip replace the screws with stainless
not going to replace the screws if I can't get this thing working though. I mean, how funny would that be? Yeah, man, thing works really well. Screws do. <laughs> Don't think this is going to do anything, but I've got it. Let's see if it'll blow any dust off of there. Nope, it's all out of charge. It's all out of charge. Need a wire to stick in there. Excuse me. I'm burping up my breakfast cookies in your ear, y'all. It's, it's not going to be a how-to. <laughs> this is not a how-to video. This is a fingers crossed so I don't have to buy a new smoker. Can I fix this smoker video? And if I can, we'll smoke some stuff. Maybe this Allen key will fit in there. Really tiny, tiny Allen key. Will you fit in that hole? Nope, you won't. Need to get something to fit in that port. Saw a set of pliers earlier. This is how the food boat meets its demise. Yeah, it's broken. It doesn't want to light. I figure I go live with you. Maybe I got lucky. I do get lucky. If I do get lucky, I can uh, cook with you. If I can't cook with you, I don't know if you can hear it. I smell it though. Maybe that's enough. Maybe that's enough. Sure. Getting spark.
getting spark. And I heard and smelled gas this time, which was nice. Only problem is, is the boat's on bottom right now. And uh, as you can see, we got a pretty good gust of wind. I don't really have anything to block that wind. check chat. I'm sure some of y'all are yelling at me right now. What's up, Stray Bullet? Good to see you. Dwinsel. Nah, tank's, tank's brand new tank. Slap full. Slap full of gas. <laughs> Wait, are you saying this is uh, this is how we get food boat 3.0? Dad, dad goes north. Dad heads north and I burn the place down. Is that what you're saying? I think that's what you're saying. <laughs> oh, shit, man. What movie was that? Shit fire! <laughs> Shift fire. In the military, we say shift fire and lift fire. But in that movie, they said S H I T. Uh, we are we going to be able to do this in this wind? I hear the train is coming. There's a rolling around the bend. I got gas! <laughs> well, that's good news. Boof! <laughs> oh, man. I got, I got fire. I got fire, y'all. So now, I'm just trying to get some smoke rolling in here. Shit. It won't stay lit because of the wind. I promise you, the wind wasn't the issue the other day. It was not lighting. There was something in there. So it's clear now. I just got to figure out a way to keep it lit. And, uh, yeah. Let's, uh, let's get to smoking some chicken bacon ranch for lunch. Lunch, folks. I do have um, store-bought macaroni and cheese, I believe. Or potato salad. At the very least, potato salad. It is a little bit of low flow. I'm going to see if I can't get it. It's a very low flow. How do you fix that? Derek was singing Johnny Cash. Why would I have low flow? Here yeah, they're trying to come. Is 
Is there a pill for this? Is there a pill I'm supposed to give it? My dad does his best. Comes here, keeps the boat clean the entire time he's here. And then he leaves. And I'm like, yeah, let me just pull this here, do that. Whatever. I don't need to block that wind. I don't need to block that wind. Speaking of that. Yes, sir. Where you at? West Virginia. Well, I got fire, but it won't stay lit. I've got low flow issues. Not sure how to fix this. So you got what, four hours, three and a half? Yeah. Okay. Okay. That works. Yeah, I'm I'm live on YouTube though, so we can talk about that later. All right, Dad. Love you. <laughs> Dad, Dad saw me live and wants to make sure I'm not blowing up his work. All right, what we got going on? Is there anyone telling me how to fix this low flow issue or do I got to Google it? Looks like I got to Google it. Google it. Bad regulator or unplugged? Or plugged, oh, or plugged. No, dad didn't instruct me about the smoker. He just told me not to kill myself. So don't blow yourself up for views. What did Harvey say? Getting yelled at. Y'all always feel like you're about to witness a tragedy here on the food boat. That's what I do, right? Provide you with live entertainment. Stray, Stray's smoker just plugs into holes in the wall. Okay. Twins, it's upside down. <laughs> y'all, y'all aren't all sorts of help here. Check the regulator for spider webs and flow. Yeah, I turned it upside down. I checked the regulator. Um, <laughs> Derek going flying is funny, but not Mariner. Dad remembers the generator incident. The blowout. Y'all got jokes. They got jokes, man. They got jokes. And the fire was funny. It was. Let's go back out there. Let's go back out there.
Mariner does have a lot of faith in me. Mm, you got a lot of faith in me, Mayor. I think it is a problem at the regulator. How do I fix that now? I think it is a problem here. There's a lot of pressure in there. I've never had that happen before. Hey. I think that's what it is. Are you watching the live and telling me, you know, no, that's what it is or what? Because I, 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 I flipped it up. Yeah, I flipped it upside down. The, the tip at, at the smoker, too, is a little corroded, probably from salt. So I don't know if it's the regulator or what. I think it is the regulator because it looks like low flow because I got it lit now, but it just won't, it won't fucking... Huh? Tap on? I got a hammer. Yeah. Okay. Bye bye. Oh. Um, Y'all, I'll give you three guesses as to who that was. But I don't think you're going to need three. Uh. Somebody who usually saves my ass. Somebody who usually saves my ass. Just called. <laughs> Joe Keating, yep. <laughs> Joe Keating called. That's exactly who that was. He called and goes, Can we just buy you a new regulator? That's why I said, Are you watching the live? Because now. I'm not getting anything. Now I'm not getting anything. Food bus said hit it with a hammer 20 minutes ago. <laughs> now I'm not getting any flow. It's definitely a regulator. Probably is a clogged hose or a regulator.
we got these amazing creatures here in the south called dirt daubers. They love to just put mud everywhere. Now I hear water. Now I hear water. Why would I hear water? Because it's a liquid propane. Is there flow on the flow on the because if I take this off, you can hear it. Mess with it. Oh, man. I think Joe has another propane tank under the Stay there. You Oh, what do you say, man? You gonna be able to cook today? Hope so. I hope so.
<laughs> Sounds catchy as shit. I'm getting tired of this wind. Take the hose off the smoker. Yeah, it's definitely a regulator, Joe. I see you watching, because it's uh, building up gas at the valve. It's just not letting it go past that regulator. Problem is the wrench is in the damn car, so I gotta walk again. That's a great place for it is the car. Leave y'all here so you can assess the situation on your own. You'll have all sorts of solutions for me by the time I get back. Oh, that's a dead crab. Is it a dead crab or is it a shell? Could be a shell of a crab, of a peeler crab. See it right there? Could be a peeler crab. ADD's kicking in now. Give me a minute. Curious. If you haven't watched that video, it's a pretty cool video. Where you see they pretty much just, they lose everything, right? They get new gills, all that. Leave it, man. Leave it.
Ah! Fell apart. I don't think that was a peeler, though. Something made it. I think it met its demise. Could have been a peeler. Leave it alone, man. Leave it alone. It was a male. So, no, it wasn't a peeler. Leave y'all there and go for a walk. I'll be right back. Have y'all ever watched Alone? If there's something, don't eat it. It'll get you sick. Most candidates on Alone get sent home. They drink dirty water. So don't eat those. Coming for a walk?
All right, can you hear me now? I think you can hear me now. I walked away for too long and the mic decided it wasn't gonna work. So I think it's transmitting now. Y'all should be good. Uh, I did not go to North Carolina. I, uh, I parked right where I always park. I used the wrench trying to get the regulator off of Joe's grill and it proved to be more of a feat than, uh, than anything. So Joe's at the hardware store anyways. He's picking up another regulator. He'll be here in a few minutes and uh, we'll get this thing squared away. So let's go back out there and get the other regulator off to get ready for, uh, for Joe. So the chicken bacon ranch is being developed for uh, smokehouse concepts. That's why I want to smoke it. I've cooked some up already. It's a very delicious sausage. The problem is, is the applewood smoked bacon is a very subtle smoke. And you want to taste that smoke when you're eating bacon, right? So today, I'm going to smoke it on a blended smoke. Hopefully, the flavor profile is good, and we can uh, finally bring this applewood smoked bacon, I mean, I'm sorry, bring this chicken bacon ranch to market. However, in the meanwhile, we made our pork southern classic into a chicken sausage. We called it the chicken southern freaking delicious freaking delicious and uh it's selling like crazy we've only got one user for it right now I don't think it's the regulator. Damn it. <laughs> it's not the regulator. It's whatever that little unit is. I uh, should have done this sooner. I mean, the, there's gargling going on in there, so that's not good. There's a, there's a fair amount of flow. I took it off of the port. Yeah. There's well, a, all right, I'm almost home. I can take it back if I need to. Okay. I, what I'm saying is that might not be the issue. It might be something else altogether. I don't know now. I don't yeah. know. I don't know if I have to hunt down that little port that it attaches to on the smoker or what. Let's see. I'll be there in just a minute. I'm, okay. I'm right around the corner. All right. See you in a few. All right. All right. Bye. Bye. Check the nozzle for webs with the hose off. I know, I know, Brandon. I'm an idiot. <laughs> when you're dumb, you got to be tough. I'm tougher than I am smart, so there's that. But let's uh, perhaps get y'all in here to see. Will it focus? Come on, focus. See, this thing's only, this is, this is the problem with salt water too. Maybe I need a Coca-Cola to clean it up. 
Maybe I need a Coca-Cola to clean it up. Come on. I don't want to focus at all. Find places to set you down. It needs to be something I need to work on too. Plenty of flow there. I can see it. Plenty of flow. Probably needs a certain pressure that I can't provide. Hey, Joe's walking up. We'll get it sorted. Yeah, Joe's walking up. I'm going to get it sorted. Just break it. Okay, let me go, Brandon. All right. Bye. Yeah. It broke. He gonna whoop your ass. You eat his food. gotta be yeah it's gotta be they don't want to hear what you gotta say <laughs> <laughs> nope that's opening you can see it open i know it's open but if you if you um Grab the port, you'll see, I mean, grab the hose at the tank, and you'll see uh, there's plenty of gas getting to it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's got plenty of flow there. So it's this port. Can you take this off? Yeah, I had it off. Um, where's my... 
You can take this off. Yeah. Well, you might, did you clean this inside here? As best I could. It'd be nice if I had like a wire. Yeah, the, what do you call them? The, what you used to clean pipe rifles cleaners, with? Yeah. yeah, the pipe cleaner. I've got one. This is broke, broke? Yeah. <laughs> it's dry rotted. It's, it's weak. But you don't need it. It's nice. It is windy out here. It's windy as hell. take this off let me get this out of the way first I don't remember how just like that yeah can you take this these off I'll take that to the compressor or I can bring the compressor here I, I bet it's this orifice right here do you have the the attachment for the hose yeah oh, yeah it's up there I mean, we've got a compressor here. Yeah. I just I don't have that attachment to blow it out. What do you have? Huh? You got a nail gun, right? Yeah. Just take the thing off the back of the nail gun. Right to me or to you? Me. To you, yeah. Let me hold it for you. Right, it's a pretty day. Mm -hmm. You been in there yet? No. now <laughs> it is pouring out try it try it now you want to just yeah attach to that right and see if you can light that we put the wrench here Plenty? No. Huh? I didn't feel anything. Leave it open? It, it was flowing. You... I heard it. Let me just get it and put okay. I was playing with the nozzle. Okay. You ready to open it? Yep. Yeah, it's got airflow. Let me... Here. You got something you can light it with? Hmm? You can light that. 
<laughs> There's the. What do I do with it? There it is. I turn it back off. Yeah, so it's not just flowing everywhere. Get that close, go ahead and hook it up. Huh? Okay. You ready, Charmel? Yep. Yes, no. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they were all hoping for it. <laughs> Some of them were saying Food Boat 3.0 is about to come out. Yeah. Oh, man. That's good. Hey, you're in. Uh, you can take that regulator back. All the way back to zero. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I like saying it. Dog's name was hey. Indiana. Indy, come, <laughs> come here. Something scaring her. Huh? Probably marrying her. Oh. He fucking laid into her twice yesterday. Got a big old belly. She might be looking for a place to go poop, too. No, we took care of that on the way up. I'm sticking in your bed for a while. Make, make up for the possum. <laughs> Put it on top of that thing. Yeah, I think it's enough. That's it. I gotta figure out how to block the wind for it so I can smoke some sausage. You got a bunch of sausage in your refrigerator needs to be cooked. You want me to get it? Hmm? You want me to get it? Maybe. What's the matter with you? Come here. I can... uh, what's the matter? What are you scared of? Huh? What are you scared of? But we got flame, that's for sure. Oh yeah. I will get the sausage. It's up on the top shelf. Do I have to leave this here? Oh, you can take that with you. Uh you mind if I steal a cutting board, some tongs, and a knife for now too? Alright. Yep. What's that? That's it. Thanks, sweetheart. <laughs> Joe Keating, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Andy, Andy, yes, yes, he is. Yes, he is. All right, let's uh, let's get some smoke rolling, huh? Let's get some smoke rolling. Hague just texted said he's gonna be here in about fifty minutes. Oddly enough. I might have this sausage ready by then. Oh, there's 
go the other way. Let me go the other way. They go the other way. Oh, crooked. Why are you crooked? Straighten yourselves out this morning. <laughs> where, oh, where would an idiot put the paper towels? Thank you, sir. Your hands are all dirty. Yeah, I'll just grab here and there. More paper towels hiding somewhere. Wood chips are not soaked in kerosene, they're soaked in water. What wood smokes better? This is why they're wet. Everyone's asking, how do you get smoke from wet? It's wet wood smokes. Dry wood just burns. All right. Taught her, huh? Yeah, she don't want to mess. She don't, she don't want to go near Mary. No. no. Yeah, yesterday, I'm convinced. Yesterday, she got between him and his food, and he said, "Don't do that." <laughs> Emphatically, he said, "That is my food." Huh, man? You tell that poor puppy it was your food. I was thinking. Probably so. It's all come from the same direction.
my dog. Don't kill my pup. I ain't never smoked rope like that before in there, so we're gonna find out. Good. We'll find out how this does. Yeah. Huh? We'll find out how. Is it's that there. all you have? That's a lot. Is that all you have? Yeah. I was going to take some and cook it the other way. Oh, no, no. It's it's made to be smoked. It's okay. Yeah, it's got the pink salt in it, the Karen salt. Okay. It's made to be smoked. It, it'll mess with you, too, because it's a chicken sausage, but because it's got the pink salt in it, it's going to be pink, like a kielbasa or andouille. You know, and some people are like, oh, what's this about? And it's, like, it's a smoked sausage. It's supposed to be that color. How long does it take to smoke it? It's going to take probably 40 minutes. Ooh. <laughs> you going to be nice, that little puppy. Huh, Mayor? You know, you better be nice. <laughs> They're working it out. <laughs> Mayor. <laughs> <laughs> Mayor, hey! <laughs> <laughs> Mayor! You're not catching on, Indy. This is not good for you. <laughs> it's really something to see Mariner act like that. Yeah. He's such a nice dog. He, I, I don't know what it is about puppies, though. <laughs> he does not like himself a puppy. Plus, there's food in the game now, right? Yeah. Food has entered the arena. There, be nice to that puppy. And once food enters the chat, yeah. he's a different dog. Oh, it looks like it. Huh? It looks like it. Yeah. Can I have this? You want that one? <laughs> oh, that's forever. Yeah, that one ain't coming off. Well, smoke smells good. Yeah, it does. Let's get the meat smelling good. Let me check this out. Hey, hey, move, move. It's a lot of work. Yeah, Dad, Dad did a phenomenal job, didn't he? Yeah, he did. It's a lot of work. still work to do oh all sorts of work needs to be done still dad's coming back in june to finish it <laughs> thinks we'll be finished renovating by then uh -huh. mom and dad are coming in june yeah he told me he told me they got an airbnb this time though that's uh yeah, the airbnb last time just the downstairs yeah show them because this is this is one of the things they're watching right they want to see me blow up but they also want to see me cook stuff so that's the 
chicken bacon ranch. Now we just gotta wait. Now it's a waiting game. Can y'all uh, mark the time? Let me know what time it is. 12.31. 12.31, okay. All right, well, now let's just hang out. Now let's just hang out and wait for Chicken Bacon Ranch to be ready. Probably gonna change out of the hoodie. Why is that speaker on? Turn off. Speaker on. Ready to connect. Connection successful. Power button must not be working. You got shit to do, or are you hanging out? Um, you don't know. I think I want to put a battery charger on that jet ski. What is that? A bucket to sit on. It's a seat. It's yeah. a seat. You didn't recognize that? <laughs> You've been rich too long, haven't yeah. you? <laughs> yeah, I got chairs. It's awful. <laughs> what? You want to chew the bottle? Huh? Man. Hmm. Mayor, you better be nice. Hmm. So I did a Q and A with my dad yesterday. Yeah. Pretty interesting responses. <laughs> you know the one thing that kind of caught me by surprise? What would you guess? My dad is a Greek Italian Mediterranean man. Yeah, his dad's Italian, his mom's Greek. What would you guess is the favorite thing that his mom made him to eat? Of meat? Lamb? No, made him to eat. Oh, I don't know. What, what do you think his favorite dish would be? Spaghetti. Right? Uh, Either or lamb. Like some sort of pasta or lamb or uh, you know, something Mediterranean, right? Yeah. Shepherd's pot. I like that too. Shepherd's pie. Like, oh, it's one of my go tos, especially like when yeah. it's cold and rainy. The other day when it was raining a lot, I was like sitting there. I was like, hey, gas. She's like, where do you want to go to lunch? I was like, I kind of want to go to O'Brien's and get a shepherd's pie. They have it over there? Huh? Yeah. Is it good? Yeah, it's okay. That's why you went. Yeah. But, um, man, man, <laughs> he's like showing his teeth like crazy. And <laughs> she's just getting all up in it. She just wants to play. She wants to play. With the wrong person. This is not going to end well. <laughs> <laughs> it's breezy. Shepherd's pie. Yeah. It's cool. I like it, too. Oh, I love good shepherd's pie. I just didn't know. Yeah. I, I didn't expect that answer. Yeah. I'm going to take her over to Mandy's house and let her play. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, he gets you oh, good. Oh, 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 that hurt. Oh, that's okay. That's okay. Oh, oh he got her. He got her. Oh, he, I don't know. He got her though. Mayor. 
her lips, I think. You just did that on live YouTube. Yeah. Everyone's going to know you as a jerk now. Yeah. You bit the puppy on YouTube. Live. <laughs> huh? You got a good one, that one, huh? Yeah, you ain't going to do that again. I know. It's just a little spot. Chat saying Mariner's jealous, and I think they're right. He's jealous that puppies get all the attention. He's got a big fat belly. You get that heat up a little. Yeah. <laughs> you don't want to get nose to nose, okay? Don't do that. <laughs> you get right in his face. Right in his face. He only has to move a quarter of an inch. <laughs> He's like showing his teeth the whole time as she's yeah. doing it too. For all the ladies in chat, you're gonna get mad at me when I say that's a typical woman move. Oh, is this bothering you? <laughs> you don't like that? What's wrong with you? You don't like this when I do this? <laughs> 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 oh, no. <laughs> oh. Man, you leave that dog alone. Be nice, Mariner. That dog might get bigger than you. She might. <laughs> when you're old, she's going to be young and nimble. <laughs> It's amazing. Day to day, you can still tell the dog grew. Yeah. It's amazing how much they put on early. Yeah. I'm not. What's the temperature? Oh, did it blow out? I don't know if it blew out or not. Can't quite see it. Can you see it underneath? Maybe. I don't see anything. Yeah. There it is, oh. nothing. No. Turn up. It's burning now. Oh, I just turned it on. Is that high? Yeah. Gotta fly blind now. No, it, it tells you. That's high there, right? Do you want to know high? I need to get that temperature up. Okay. Unless I, the thermometer's done too, which very well could be. I mean, it's rolling with smoke. I love that. I love those rolling with smoke. What temperature do you want? Like 200? Yeah, usually between 2 and 250 is what I like to be. Yeah, it's climbing now. We're good. Yeah, you're almost to two.
No smoking now. Yeah. Wow. Now I just need to make sure it doesn't roll away. It's not quite a 200. It's good there. It's good there. You can go get Keating, come back and shoot some. I yeah. Keating loves that. It's fun. It is it's fun. Good fun. You got everything I need. Do you have a battery charger here? No. Yeah, this is a lot of work. You can see how much work he's done. Yeah. yeah. Does the doors work? I see. I need to put the hardware in. And this is the bathroom door here? Yeah. Wow, he did great. Didn't he? He did very well. He's a good old boy. Let me get that camera. We're in here walking around and they can't see it. Some of y'all have seen it. Some of y'all haven't. There's Indy. She survived the massacre. <laughs> Indy, come here. Hey. But yeah. Uh, by the way, Andy, if you're in here, Andy Mrak, your freaking all-star sending that. All of y'all that have sent, really, really appreciate everything you've sent. This is uh, this has proven to be quite the expensive build. It was really cool. Did he get her ear? Yeah, that's what he got. Gotcha. It's okay. It's really cool. Still got a bunch to do, like Joe said, but it's getting there. I need to get um, Zach here, Joe. Yeah. I talked to him yesterday. Did you? Be nice to get the electrical and the plumbing sorted. I don't know if I'm going to put the fryer back on. Why? You don't like it? Oh, I love the fryer. There's not enough room? What do you think? I, I tried first, then see. Yeah. You need the hood. Yeah, it's going to need the hood again. I just don't like that the hood comes out the side. The hood's going to get tied up on pilings and stuff at the boat ramp. So you need a different hood. Yeah. Oh, who's that? Probably Haig. <laughs> oh, it's Tracy. She's watching you. Probably. Hey, how you doing? You watching or are you trying to... <laughs> are you watching the live right now? Is that what you're calling about? Or... <laughs> uh, St. John's fundraiser. No, I'm not involved with I'm not involved with the um I know he's probably coming by here today, but I don't I don't know. He had stuff to do out in Mount Pleasant today. Yeah. Okay, that'd be great. Yeah, I'm 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 live right now, and so is Joe. So let me let me put Joe in there, so you can see him. If you if you go back to this point, you can see him laughing at you. <laughs> Hi, Tracy. He's, he says, "Hey, Tracy." <laughs> Bye. So she was not watching. No, no, she was calling because she was um she was assuming I'm going to this fundraiser that Fred has tonight. 
Where is it? I don't know. Don't know. Fred might be coming by for. And we're going to a birthday party. Tommy Srisky. Oh, 6'5 six, or 6'6 six, six is here? 6'5, six, I think. All right, that temp is climbing. Let's dial it back. Which way is it dialed back? This way? Yeah. If you put that on there, to put the knob on there, it gives you an idea where you're at. Some idiot wouldn't have broke it. Does it? Yeah. This put way. the flat spot there, yeah. That's about where you are. Okay. Yeah, I don't, don't want to climb it too much. So the ideal temperature is 200? I like it between 2 and 250. I mean, you need to get the sausage to, you know, 160, 165. And you don't want to take it past that. Mariner, we're not giving you any because you've been bad. <laughs> He ain't even looking at you. Because <laughs> he knows Emily's going to get it. Yeah. He ain't even <laughs> looking at you. Trying to kill my you. dog. He's like, whatever, man. You like that hammock swing? <laughs> <laughs> is it for the dog? What is it for? It's for people. <laughs> How's it? Oh, to sit in? Yeah. It's no, a, I don't like it. It's a chair. It's not. It's not for men. <laughs> yes, it's for women because different is better for us. Better is better. Yeah, our our seat is the bucket. <laughs> That's right. I take it. Who's has anybody said? Did you try to sit in? It? I tried sitting. It holds me. Okay, it'll hold you. Then, then I know I'm safe. Yeah. The dogs are separated. <laughs> she put a she put a metal structure between her and Mariner. <laughs> <laughs> She's safe as long as you don't get nose to nose. Yeah. Double dog dare me to sit in it. Oh, Tracy's in here. Mm. <laughs> there you are, Trace. Tracy was calling a couple different things. The main thing is Fred and I are going to be doing a little bit of filming together, showing, doing a video about how to buy fish from a market because he talked about it when we were at the boat show. Um, and we're going to actually go to a market, which... Tracy's husband, Dan, is the president of Crosby Seafood. So we're going to go to Crosby and show you what to look for when you're buying fish from a market. Mariner loved his treats. Mariner's treats are gone. He ate all three bags. He, he was a glutton. So they've been in 20 minutes now, huh? Yeah, there's a lot of work left to do to this thing. Oh, man. Finishing as always. I just want to get the spuds working and the motor working. Because it's, you know, it's dried in. So now it's just cosmetics and aesthetics. This is um this is the look I'm going to go for, Joe. <laughs> I'm going to end up painting that over the white now. Wow. Where's the, are you going to get some metal from me? I, I don't know. I'm not worried about the metal on the roof. I'm more worried about that's the look I'm going to go for on okay. the sides. Because you ain't walking on that roof. No. Oh, I see. Yeah. Yeah, so, yours will be a flat roof. That's right. Yeah. That's a look.
Fred's fundraiser Sunday is at Shanaki. Oh, is that's he, tomorrow. What are you raising money for? Huh? What is he raising money for? I don't know. I'll have to check it out. I don't know what he's raising money for. Ralph says, hey. Hey, Ralph. Good to see you, Ralph. <laughs> Ralph was a freaking champ when we were up in Baltimore. Ralph, Ralph took us, showed us around town, showed us where to eat, did all that stuff. Ralph does these uh, mini tractor pulls, Joe. Reminds me of a... Uh, Just put this on. Reminds me of Tim Allen <laughs> from um, Home Improvement. Reminds me of Tim Allen from Home Improvement where him and Bob Vila, when they have the souped up yard tractors. <laughs> that's, what, that's what Ralph does. It's really cool to see. He's got these really souped up tractors. Let there be light. Let that be light. I got to get some mounts mounted so I can put cameras up now. I'm not, I don't you have, have more than one camera around? Huh? Do you have more than one camera? Uh, this one's not plugged in yet, but there's that one. Um, and then I've got the two camcorder ones hiding somewhere probably today is a good time to start figuring out camera placement so I'm gonna start cooking with people do they get a glare if they go through the glass no they're good with the glass if I keep that glass clean yeah <laughs> Oh, Chef Civi came in under budget. Congratulations. <laughs> it's always important. See, that temp wants to climb now. I don't hold it 250. Still got smoke rolling out, which is good. Sorry, girl. I don't wanna. I'm tired of moving around the ladder. Indigo's losing her protection. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. What's going on? Is that how, oh, is that? That's what the wall's gonna look like. This? Yeah. Yeah. You know, you could use that wood that we have over there for the outside. Oh, so the outside, I'm thinking of just doing furring strips, painting, doing furring strips, and then like I, I don't want to add any more weight to the boat. Right. So I mean, it's like you come up close and inspect, but then doing that. Right, you come up close and inspect, and you're going to tell it's how heavy is what you built on the boat. Uh, we're about we're about where it needs to be. Not much. Did you measure it, or you huh? just tell me how it looks? Uh, I lost track of what the weight is. What? What is it, like ten thousand pounds? It's somewhere around ten, ten, eleven thousand. Yes. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Which is the tractor? The tractor. Yeah. 
Yeah. Really? I mean, each one of those eight by eights is 200 pounds. You know, I tried to go as light as I can on stuff. But I don't think it's going to make any difference at all. Do you? Big thing you is really getting think? in out of your creek. Uh, well, how much more draft do you have then? I'm down about another two, three inches than I was last year. I want to be hard getting in and out of the creek. That way it'll Yeah, that way it'll open the creek. Out. Yeah. Yeah. We need to get the boats back on the water. We need to get the boat running and I'll start doing it again. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. You start going. It made a difference. Huge difference. So how long has it been now? Three years? What's that? Since we were running the boats up and down. Four years. Four years since we did it for a long time, yeah. Mm -hmm. Since we did it regularly. Yeah. I got to throw my shoes on and go pick up rocks in here. That last party you had, the kids love throwing those granite rocks off your dock. There's little meteors between me and the ramp here. <laughs> when, I, when I came out after the party, I'm like, I was like looking at the pluff mud. I'm like, what are those craters? Where'd they get them from? The, the, the driveway? No, they're grabbing, they're grabbing the freaking oh, riprap. So it had to be the older kids. That ain't Rafa doing that. No. Nah. Yeah, you know, I asked GME. Nothing else to do. Hey, let's go throw some rocks. Yeah, I asked GME. I said, did your friends? Yeah. I said, don't do that again. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, they were all proud of it, right? Oh, this is going to be great. You did good. Yeah, you, know, you planned it out well. You can drive with this. Yeah. I bet the helm station's going to be nice, all of it. What you need is a way to, you're going to put a camera back there so you can see the spuds? Yeah. They're up or down. Yeah, I want to put a monitor right up there, right? So I can see. And what I do is I've got, where's the second switchboard? This switchboard here can go at the helm and control four cameras from the helm. So I can put the camera there when I'm talking underway. And the idea is an aft port and starboard camera. And then that also gives me the visual. And then that'll all go back to the back here. I think I was supposed to be able to have eight, but I think the third one got wet. So I think I'm only down to... What is this? That's going to be a shower. Oh, because you get on the other side. Okay. Huh? You have on the other side of the toilet. Yeah. That's going to be a shower. Oh, got some courage back up. <laughs> That's not good. He's going to come get you. <laughs> He's going to get you. <laughs> he don't care. As long as he's not eating, huh? Yeah. There we go. Right now, he's just worried about that sausage. Yep. He knows that's coming. Yeah. He said, go ahead and eat that dog food. How long do you leave it in the water? Is it soaking up water? The the wood? Yeah. Yeah, the wood stayed in, I mean the wood went in the water, let's say Saturday. Okay. I put the wood in the water probably Thursday. Cause I was planning on smoking this stuff yesterday, but I couldn't get that thing to light. 
Prosa. So we're 30 minutes in, 32? Yeah. Yeah, the range, the range is definitely gas. Everything, anything that's got to create heat is going to be gas. You got to generate way too much power to create heat otherwise. What's up, Ralph? Good to see you in chat. Ralph is a godsend for Andy. Have you seen any of the videos from Baltimore? I Joe? saw a little bit of it. It was good. Yeah. It was interesting. What little we know, know about marine work, getting started is the hardest part. They'll start getting, they'll start finding a pace, you know, and get yeah. that, get that going. I will say this, Andy, I know he's listening. Andy got a little bit upset with me at dinner the one time because he was saying Coast Guard runs the site. I said, it's blocking navigable waterway. That's Army Corps' job. Mm -hmm. You know, Army Corps of Engineers, I don't think they're all that much in the wrong for sitting there saying, this is the scope of work. This is what needs to get done. Stop with the bureaucracy. Stop with all of it. We got to get this channel opened up. If is it was it, just it open now, huh? Is it open yet? No, they'll have it open by the end of the month. Yeah. But and some serious stuff goes through there. Oh yeah. Every day. Well, you're not happy, huh? You're not happy. Well, she was comfortable on here. <laughs> she was comfortable enough to pee and poop on here yesterday. Did she? Uh -huh. She here? In here. Oh, It's all good. Hey, they can't wait. They, yeah. they can't hold it very long. No, I was sitting there. I'm like, oh, that dog's got to go. And yeah. next thing you know, she's going. Yeah. Let's see what she does. <laughs> she won't go up that thing yet. She won't do the ramp yet? Not yet. Let me see if I, I'm going to take her over there. I'll be right back. All right. Let her go. Come on. You say, huh? You say. You ashamed for nipping at the dog yet, huh? You hiding because you feel bad? Is that what it is? Oh, come on now, climb. Still got a flame. Need to get that heat back up, bud. So stop opening the door and the heat will climb up. Mariner says go away. <laughs> Leave me alone. These are high chews, they're not for you. Yeah. yeah, I know I need a bigger shirt. I was talking to the lady yesterday, or not yesterday, a few days ago. I need to order longs. I 
I need to order longs. Dog friendly ice cream. What Derek needs to do is he needs to lose weight. He needs to lose weight. Clothes fit better when I lose weight too. That'd be the proper answer to do. smoke right in my face. One twenty seven. One twenty seven. Still got a ways to go. What's that? In other words, <laughs> every time I tune in to see what Chef Sivy is cooking, I get extremely hungry and end up overeating because she cooks some amazing food. If you haven't jumped in to see her live streams, God, such good food, such good food. I need to put a Bluetooth thermometer on the, uh, on the wish list, I guess, right? Uh-oh, here comes Haig. You got a new one, huh? You got a new one. Yeah, come on. I'm glad I didn't bring my dog. <laughs> Why, she likes dogs? Oh, my God. Oh, she... oh good. It's your buddy, man. It's your buddy. There, it's Haig. It's Haig. It's your buddy. You saw that he was on? Huh? You saw that he was on? It's your buddy. Yeah. Oh. It's your buddy. Oh. oh. It's your buddy. <laughs> no, 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 don't go down that. <laughs> yeah. If you go down that forward backwards. like you would stairs, you can put your hand right up here, here. or you can just go down backwards. Cut. Either way. I won't put it on camera. But you can go down forward like you would a set of stairs. Hey. I'm holding on. Mariner. Good to see you. You too. Hey, buddy. Oh, there you go, pup. Mare, come on. She's afraid of Mariner more than the ramp, I think. <laughs> come on, Mare. Leave that puppy alone. Come on. Leave that puppy alone. There you go. Come on. So how are you doing, sir? Doing good. I mean, yeah. you know, I've heard about you for, I don't know, what, four years now? Yeah, you want a mic up? <laughs> We're, we're live. We're like yeah. two hours. Everybody's live. listening to you. So they'll be like, "Who is this guy?" They're asking if you're the guy from earlier. No, the guy from earlier was Sam. This is Haig. This is the boss man. Yeah, there you go. What's up? How are you? Yeah, that's the I'm, puppy. That's the puppy. Yeah, she got a little too so, close to Mariner. So I've Mariner. heard. I've heard of Joe Keating <laughs> for years and years from Derek. First yeah. time we're meeting. Yeah, that is true. Yeah. Yeah, we avoid each other. <laughs> is Jim here? He left. He, he left, left at 4 a.m. this morning. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Have you been here before? Here? Yeah. Yes. I mean, yeah. I haven't I haven't been in your home, but I yeah. mean, yeah. We yeah. were well, I went out on the on the barge. On yeah, we the boat, had a three hour cruise on the food boat. Oh, yeah. 
and my yeah. buddy actually fixed it. <laughs> That's who fixed it. Yeah, yeah he, we, we're not living that one down, right? <laughs> no, there's no reason to. Well, it was electrical, and he's, you know, he's got one of those. He can do that. Yeah, he's, yeah. he's, he's, uh, well, welcome. He's just come anytime. One, thank you. He's he's well, he's one of those guys get, that can fix just about anything. It's good to see you. Well, we got smoke rolling on the chicken bacon ranch, hey? Oh, nice. How long before it's done? It was at one twenty-seven a couple minutes ago. Oh, so it's close. But it's got that temp has to climb back up because it when I opened it up, it went down. So. You get that temp back up. Well, show me. Uh, I mean, this is beautiful. This is great. Like the, the robust eight by eights. I love. Yeah. I mean. Does it look like a Netflix show now? I mean, it. Those puppies aren't going anywhere. Well, they just look better. You didn't need that much. They or do they, look they better. Look cool. Yeah, yeah, for sure. They definitely look cool. But, yeah. well. Tell Jim he does great work. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm sorry I missed him. Yeah, he just left this morning. Yeah, like early, early this morning. I had to I had to get up at midnight to move the boat back to the dock. And uh, at four, Dad calls. He's like, I'm leaving. Oh, man. Yeah. Well... Like you said, he's been here two weeks. Yeah. So. You want to go in and check it out? I do. Yeah. So that's acoustic paneling that they put up. They put it up here. So it'll be really good for the live streams and. Yeah, less reverb. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, the doors were the thing he was doing this week. Okay. He's got one here and one on the other side. This is for the toilet and that's for the shower. Oh, the toilet is in there. Yeah, well, that's going to go in the other room. It's not okay. in yet. Okay. But it's going to go in. And this and is. going to be a shower in that hole. Right. This is stuck right now. But yeah. this is the door? Yeah, that's the door. Here. Bye. Are you going to do the Ace Ventura? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what that is. <laughs> yeah. Slam the door and open the door. <laughs> so that it's quiet inside. No, no, I'll spare you that. <laughs> I will spare you that. Wow. Yeah, I mean, that's going to be the bed, obviously. And then <laughs> this is going to be, I got to get it organized and cleaned up. That'll be the workstation. So I got to figure out where everything's going to go. Soon. That's really cool. Yeah. And then there's your favorite point. Spuds down. Spuds down! They're up right now. Man. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> I see the bolt. I mean, you know what? In in some ways, I had thought when you were telling me you were building all this, I'm thinking, man, it's going to feel real small. It's just the opposite. Yeah. It feels really big. So whoever designed it, if it was you or whoever, kudos, because it's really nice. It was in my head, and I didn't even have it on paperwork. Somehow Dad made it happen. Uh, he did. Because it, <laughs> I mean, it's, I mean, because you have, I mean, look, you have plenty of room back here to do what you got to do engine-wise, and you have some storage back here, right? Yeah. Anything that could be outdoors. As long as it's just one person. And you've got your tech center going, plus your bedroom. Which of course means you can watch TV in bed. Right? Yeah, I know, I know. Right? <laughs> What's the puppy's name? Indigo. Indigo, love it. <clears throat> Her coat is interesting. It's a labradoodle. Okay, okay. Yeah. Now, is it a, a full size labradoodle? Full size lab, full dog poodle, whatever standard poodle. Indigo, indigo. Can I take your picture, sweetie? Indigo, hey. indigo. I better not. If I call her, she's gonna come to me. Yeah. yeah. 
Yeah, yeah, Kelly and Moira will lose their minds. <laughs> yeah, they'll show up here in a minute. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, it was a little later than I thought because um, Kelly's friend Lucy came home from Greenville. Okay. To Kelly, visit. Kelly's your daughter? She's she's one of my daughters, yeah. yes. She's my daughter that right now is living with us. Yeah, um, she works there. Yep, yep, and she... Uh, She's been well. She's 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 had some some intestinal issues that she's Aww. battling. So she's been staying with us. But they finally diagnosed it, right? So now you can sort it out. I think so. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Let's hope so. And, and you know then, what the problem is? Is it's much easier to do something. Else. Exactly. So and Lucy is uh, her best friend. They've been friends since like eighth grade, mm -hmm. and she's an awesome young lady. And she moved to Greenville to teach, but now she's she's turns out she's moving back oh wow so um yeah i, I hadn't seen her they're asking if haig is the meat boss <laughs> he is the meat boss the sausage you, sausage you, do you know that i have the domain i know you have the boss domain. man meats yeah. and uh, boss lady meats because i wanted to do something with ecom down the road with that yeah and um you never know. I you have all know. these ideas, you know. I, I we probably own. I bet you we own what sixty domains, <laughs> probably. At one point, at one point, you're going to be able to buy stuff on yeah. the internet. One day soon. <laughs> you got the doll right behind you. Okay. Just to your right. Okay. How old? Seven weeks. Right? Wow. No, oh, no, no. Eight you've, weeks. You've had her that long. No, they, they they wean them off at eight weeks. Is that what it was? Yeah. Okay. So she's like sixteen weeks then, because they, they won't let them leave the mom. Right. Oh, that was good. She's about to do a uh, national lampoon. Chew on the cord, though. I'm going to send this off. Tim says they're waiting, Hank, for Ecom. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be by the food boat. Food boat is going to sell meat. Yeah. Aren't you? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> She's 10 weeks old. 10 weeks. Yeah. So they love... They I think they let him go in like at six weeks. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's see. She was born on my wife's birthday. Did you know? I did not know. It's on my friend's birthday. That's funny. My uh, my dog Fenway was on my dad's birthday. Yeah. <clears throat> Red Sox fans. Sounds like it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so we had a yellow lab named Fenway. And the current the current cockapoo is Guinness. Because he looks like a little Irish dog. Well, they've been in about 50 minutes now, right? Yes. That's enough, isn't it? And they're at 127. Check them out. Yeah. So you go till it's 160, right? Oh, the boat's moving, huh? Yeah, she's floating. The, tide, the tide's coming in? Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. Oh, oh it's, going, it's still moving, yeah. What kind of wood are you burning? It shouldn't be burning that much, but it's apple and hickory. I don't like that it's burning that much. Yeah, you need a water bottle or something. Yeah. I don't think that'll matter now. You got to take them out no, they or matter. reduce the air. That's it. You're almost there, though. Will that burn them? Uh, yeah. It must be the uh, the grease from the bacon dripping out. I think that's what it is. Well, didn't you use a lot of bacon? Yeah, it's very bacony. Twenty five percent bacon. <clears throat> Let's take them out and we'll just put them back in. Wow. 
look delicious. They look good. Yeah, yeah it really does. So what's the plan? You're going to burn the brake and grease off? Yeah, we got to probably turn the gas off. Well, why don't we change it out? Hmm? You want to change it out? Change what? Change the wood out. We can do that too. It's really not set up to cook just yet. I jump in the gun like I always do. I think the wood's burning by itself. I think it is. That's when it's hard to regulate the heat. Yeah. All right. Why don't I just throw this into the water? I mean, it looks mighty good. You think it's ready? If it tastes half as good as it looks, yeah, then you got to win okay, it. Yeah. You want to get that temperature at 20 more degrees. Though. Or 10 more degrees. What is it? Yeah, it has to. Is it 150? What is the temperature? It was at 147, so it's not going to climb up. To 13 degrees. <laughs> Don't go get that. That's why he's going on the way down. Ah, uh, yeah. Well, tide's coming in, it looks like. Yeah. It is. bring it back i wore the hoodie for you <laughs> did you yeah just for you just for me just for you you know because it's a nice day and <laughs> somebody's asking me should i rebrand to the boat that's me that one <laughs> <laughs> well why not i think i think you're not just cooking meat so Water, I turned it off here. Yeah, okay. Oh, oh, cool. that's okay. Yeah, yeah, no, I can put it back in. No, don't bring that. Is that enough wood? Yeah, I mean, it's just got to take more smoke. So. All right, it's all the way up. You gonna put it back in? Yeah, he's gonna put it back in. Right. Oh, you already put that back on? Okay. Yeah. I didn't see you get it out. Yeah. This is my job. <laughs> Open the door and close the door. I lift Hold things on. up and I put them down. Hold on. <laughs> Everybody has to eat 10 ounces today. Yeah. <laughs> Hank overindulged on it last time. And he's like, man, that was good, but I had indigestion. Yeah, it wrecked me. So it's two different ones, or is it both the same? They're both the same. He just he twisted some and didn't twist the other. Oh, okay. Who, who made this? You did, huh? Fred. Okay. We're trying to create a new sausage, but in haste, we had to roll another one out, Joe. Yeah. 
and the other one's selling off the freaking shelves. Wow. So now, which Hank's one is like, that? Hank's like, don't tell them about this one now. The ranch? Huh? Which one? No, so we took the Southern Classic and yeah. turned it into a chicken sausage instead of pork sausage. Oh, wow. That, that was like one of our favorites. Oh, I mean, we still make the pork, yeah. but but then we started making it in chicken because we had a customer that wanted chicken. They wanted this, but we yeah. weren't ready with this, and this yeah. it just wasn't hitting the mark. Yeah. So we sold him the other one, and what did you say? He's selling four times as much. Yeah, he was selling a competitor sausage five cases a week, 50 pounds. Brings ours in, he's selling 180, 200 pounds a week average. That's nice. Just that one item. Yeah. Yeah, he sells three sausages at once. All in about a hundred. Who is it? Max Speed Shop, North Carolina. Okay. Yeah. You talking about him? Mandy loves him. That's when we were at Mandy's house. Mandy's a friend of mine. We were yeah. at a pool party and she had their sauce around like out at like she had their barbecue sauce. And I'm like, You like Max Speed Shop? I love Max Speed Shop. Is she from Charlotte? Uh her son, right? Sterling lives in lives in Charlotte. Yeah. She's from Lancaster. She's a country girl. And then became a lawyer and moved here. Yeah, she's immigration law. She's really sharp. Okay. I gotta go get my grandson. Hey. <laughs> Are you finished? Well, it smells delicious. Yeah, it does. Yeah, it <laughs> smells delicious. It's it looks really over? good. Okay. All right. So I'll come. To, I'll come get you. So when's Dad coming right, back? June. Right. How much longer do you think it's gonna be? Oh, what do you think? Uh, 10, 15 minutes at that point. Uh, it depends. I mean, how you lost all that heat. Yeah, it's up yeah. at two hundred again right now. Is it? Well, I'll get him. I'll get him, and we'll see what happens. Yeah, there'll be plenty left. We're not eating all that. Yeah. Ten ounces each. Ten ounces each. Yeah. Buy well, indigo. To eat my dog. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, it's nice meeting you. You too. You'll probably be here when you get back. I gotta... All right. I'll see you in a bit. All right. See you. It, it's about 30 minutes. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah. It's going to take that long to cook and eat for sure. <laughs> Mariner. What do you say? So this is for the dogs. Yeah. Yeah. You scared the hell out of me. Right? How do I navigate? Oh, no, you don't navigate that. <laughs> don't do that. <laughs> I think it's like a 70-pound weight limit. <laughs> it got caught on the old boat. You can see the bend in it at the bottom here. Yeah. It got caught underneath the old structure. And uh, when it was up there, I bent the hell out of it, and I was able to bend it back a little bit. Is that a piece of timber? Yeah. Yeah. There's all sorts of stuff that's got to come up. Well, it's definitely coming along, and you got plenty of room out here. Yeah. For that podium you had, uh -huh. table, butcher block, whatever you call it, and the cooker, and even even a few chairs. Yeah. You got plenty of room. I mean, is there is there anything that you wanted to do today? You need help with anything? Really, it was get the smoker back in action, get this chicken bacon ranch cooked, because um, the audience has been rather tolerant of me. The food boat hasn't had food in months, so this is this is the inaugural okay. cook on the food boat 2.0. So this is really this is all I wanted to achieve. And okay. I, well, I mean, I'll do some other stuff later today. Okay. Well, but, I mean, if you if you if you need help doing something. Yeah. I'll help you. It's so peaceful out here. 
It doesn't suck, does it? No, no. Doesn't uh, John Laverne live around here? Yeah, he. John lives between here and the light. So further you down River take a left. Road? No, take a left. I don't know which way you came. Did you come from Maybank? You no, came, I came. Um, you came Maine. I came seventeen to Maine. To Maine to okay. River. So yeah, then further down on the left, this way. So you'd go out, Joe's take a left, and take a left. Mm -hmm. Rushland, he's in like Rushland Landing area. So is he like ten minutes from here? Uh, probably like less. Like if you're counting walking to your car, getting in the car, and going to his house. Because then Jessica is just a little bit further down as well. Yeah, I, I mean, I know where she is, but I've never been to his place. Yeah, he's like halfway between here and Jessica's. Nice. Nice. Well, just the ride, you know, just the ride down, down River Road. I mean, it's just, it's rustic and it's yeah. pretty and those homes are set so far back. Yeah. Um, huge pieces of property. So what's with the, what's with the, the guy with the, with the blue, blue, blue roof. And then he's got the matching blue caps on the, on the fence post that, aren't keeping anybody out because there's a fence but then it ends that guy has a lot of fun like if if you paid attention do you see like the little dirt trails he's he's got they'll do uh motocross racing and stuff in the yard like even though the house looks like like that house doesn't belong in the low country is that what you're the one you're thinking about it just has a, a Royal blue, roof. royal blue, <laughs> yeah, with, with, <laughs> against a white house with royal blue matching caps on yeah. his fence posts. Yeah, he's got that guy has a lot of fun though. He does a lot of motocross. Him and the grandkids, I think it's his grandkids. Well, that's cool. But. Yeah, it just it just was you know it just kind of sneaks up on you when you're driving down the road. Like what? Oh yeah, a swing a hammock chair okay i don't want to tell it because i'm live but i i've got a little surprise for my viewers <laughs> at some point okay it involves a chick and it looks like she was caught in a net type deal so. Okay. <laughs> Do I have a picture. So like that's coming. I so it'll be like one of my friends dressed up in that. Did it already? Uh, no, it's gonna happen. It hasn't happened yet. That's why I said I don't want to spoil the surprise. I'm teasing them a little bit right now because some of them are probably cluing in as to what it is. Yeah, that they, they've already picked up. <laughs> oh, gotcha. Yeah. Does the wave runner work? It does. Yeah. That that one, the battery needs to be charged. There's one out at the dock that works. I mean, those are obviously the old school version. Mm -hmm. Joe's grandkids, uh, it's a little too, it requires a little bit too much coordination for them. 
this. Yeah. Because it'll tip over. Oh, yeah. The one out there won't tip as easy, or they're both. It's the same one. It's the same one. Yeah. Now, Joe asked me, he said, they tip easy, don't they? Said, oh, yeah. Yeah, those, those ones are a sport model. Like, they're a lot of fun. Yeah, they are. Definitely. But it'll put you in the drink quick. Well, hang on here. I do have. Um, I think potato salad and macaroni salad in the fridge. I'm gonna go grab that. Okay. And then, uh, cause that that should be ready in a few minutes, right? I, mean, I would was, think so. Yeah, it was close. Yeah. I mean, you could always temp it while it's in there and see. Oh yeah, yeah. I mean, you feel free to temp you just, it. You thought it was you thought it was done. That's why you took it out. No, I took it out because the fire was running. The the, the chips caught on fire, uh, okay. and I didn't want to I didn't want to burn anything. You want me to make sure that they didn't catch back on fire? They should be fine. But I mean, I'm I'm not, I'm not worried. going to open it and lose the heat. So yeah, it, it's yeah. it's holding right around two. Yeah, I'll leave it. When it starts climbing past two fifty, that's when I know I got a problem. <laughs> okay. Mariner. <laughs> Come on out, man. Come on out. checking to see if john's around today i just texted him and just yeah i mean yeah. you never know yeah you're out this way <clears throat> did you see where 
China is trying to stop bringing in chips from the United States. Oh, really? Yeah. They're going to flex it? They're going to flex. Actually, it was an order. Huh? They ordered state-owned mobile operators. Really? Yep. Reminds me of that line from Dodgeball. Which line is that? Where they're like, looks like Average Joe's going to forfeit the, the match. Bold move, Cotton. Let's see how that plays out for him. Yeah. Don't lose your ladder. Uh-oh. Otherwise, they fall in. I would think they'd fall in when the tide's going out, but not when it's coming in. Now, when the tide goes out, it pushes me up against the dock because the the, right, the lines get shorter, as, <clears throat> so it pulls me into the dock. <clears throat> the other way, the lines get longer. We should be good now. Let's just check this oh, it's smoking nice yeah ah yeah we'll rest up for sure we're at 152 and it was climbing we'll rest up <coughs> Here, let me hold it open for you because the wind's blowing look on his face it's awesome oh. <laughs> yeah yeah you want it sealed shut yeah i'll just cut it off
But they look good. Yeah, they look really good. They really do. So the million dollar question is always oh, the, I'm sure they taste good. It's do they taste like chicken bacon ranch? Yeah. I mean the other ones were good. Yeah. You know, we could have called them chicken sausage. Chicken bacon sausage. Now what is this? It's just an accent. Are you gonna put that on the wall or are you just leaving it like that? What's that? These. They're they're, they're there. That, that's it. <laughs> yeah, mom and dad decided that that looks good. And it does. I like how it breaks it up. Well, I wouldn't argue with your dad after all this that he's done. That's amazing. Well, mom's watching. Don't argue with mom. <laughs> well, I wouldn't argue with your mother, nor should you, but yeah. um, just saying, I mean, your dad's done amazing Work. Oh yeah, they, and I'm sure your mom has sent amazing gifts. Well, almost all of the good stuff that you see is it's all from her. Is provided by her. Yeah. Mom, mom searches the internet far and wide. Oh, where's that little uh, china box thing? Ah, uh, it's in the garage. Oh, okay. okay. Yeah, we'd need to do an episode cooking with that for sure. Yeah, that would be fun. Those links are probably going to make it in the bag for you. They're the easiest one to transport. I mean, obviously, some of this is, too. But Well, and I was thinking, um, let's see how it is. Maybe we'll, maybe we'll take a little to the guys. Yeah. You know? It's definitely cooked. You don't like it? Mm. No. Do you? Something up with the consistency on it. I taste the ranch this time, though. You want to try it again? It's super soft. Hmm. Yeah, I don't think we have an item yet, though. No. <clears throat> no. It's funny how we've made so many things that, you know, one or two versions... This, like, is really stumping us. Mm -hmm. You said that one guy has a blend, right? It should be at the plant. I wonder how the, I wonder if the link is any different.
sure as heck isn't dry. Yeah. Hmm. The thing is, I don't hate it. Right. But I don't. This isn't ready to roll out. No. No, it is not. You need a paper towel or something? Yeah, they're in there on the. I think they're on the stovetop, is it? Or. I, think I got another roll somewhere. Oh. Here, here's a bigger roll. This will work. Here you go. Yeah, I mean, it's. <clears throat> and for y'all watching, like, that's the hard part. Like, we sell a lot of really good sausage, and it has to have that wow factor, and this just doesn't have the wow factor. There's something about the mouthfeel I'm not entirely sold on. Yeah. Right, because you have to get the mouthfeel, you've got to get the texture, you got to get the flavor, um, and it's also how you take, you know, if there's any aftertaste, though it's a, we've struggled on this one for a while. They know, they've been watching, they've been yelling at me, when are you ready with the chicken bacon ranch? Here, let me give you the other one too. When are you going to have the chicken bacon ranch ready? Uh, unfortunately, we may not. <laughs> yeah, because the other problem is, too, is that Southern just... Is killing it. It's killing it. Right, so... But there's no reason to introduce... Why mess with it? How many slices you want? Me? Yeah. Uh, a couple's fine. You want that? That's fine. That's plenty. Thank you. Yep. Thank you. You don't want ten ounces? Hmm. <laughs> no. I don't want ten ounces. You think the casing changed it a little? <clears throat> well, for whatever reason, the rope, I know it's the same casing, but the rope casing does seem wider than the links. Mm -hmm. I don't know why that is, other than probably stuff thicker. Right, but then, but then when you pinched it and twisted it, you would think it would have tightened it up again. Yeah. They're asking. Well, yeah, chef's in here. Chef Sivy saying. Too soft and wet, maybe the wrong binder. We don't use a binder. Mm -hmm. But milk powder is a binder itself, right? Oh, but did you put that in here? It's got buttermilk powder and sour cream powder. Okay, well, maybe then. Then maybe you do. Yeah, that's to that's to achieve the ranch flavor.
Well, maybe your audience could recommend a different flavor profile that we chase down instead of this. Yeah, there's like 30 of them in chat right now. Because this is this is about our sixth attempt at this. Yeah. It's just not happening. No. And um, you know what they say about insanity. <laughs> Same thing over and over again. <laughs> yeah. Expecting different results. Right. The funny thing is, is the patty definitely tasted different because I had a very little... different. In fact, I like the patty better than this. Mm -hmm. Sums up with the texture of this. Mm -hmm. I, I, I don't, and I don't. It's yes, the flavor is not is not on point, but there's just it seems to have a lot of moisture in it, and and it doesn't all seem to be from the bacon mm -mm. i don't know what it is you guys ground um chicken thighs don't want skin those thighs you didn't happen to read the uh the package they weren't they weren't injected were they whatever Publix. <clears throat> I'm just trying to figure out where is all that moisture coming from. How's Fred going to take it? Hmm? How's Fred going to take it? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Don't know. Hey, developing new products is not easy. Try some dehydrated apple in it. Well, we already make a yeah the chicken apple. The chicken apple people love, so it's a great idea. But we already make one, and it's yeah. very good. Yeah. <clears throat> what I might do is just put some in a. Ziploc and let Fred taste it and let Fred say. Because I, I think if he has that, we don't have to say anything. Yeah, sausage speaks for itself, right? I don't know how saleable it would be, but um, I think dehydrated apricot in a pork sausage would be really good. With with some sort of additional sweetness, maybe from honey. Yeah, I was about to say honey. Like Tim a, can get us that encapsulated like, honey, right? Like a, I would think, like a honey, like a honey apricot mm -hmm. pork sausage. Chicken cordon blue brats, bacon and maple syrup. We're already talking about the bacon and maple syrup one, right? I think we were talking about it, but we just we sell so much breakfast as it is. I think that'd be a great retail item. I don't think it'd be a good food service item. Possibly, yeah. <clears throat> it's just it's just a matter of researching and trying it out. Yeah. I mean, I'm going to check my, uh, I am on a, 
a Reddit sausage channel. <laughs> They're saying Mariner loves it. Mariner just loves food. Yeah. You want one of these? Oh, no, thank you. Did I give you a water? You need a water? That would be great. I would take a water. Thank you. <clears throat> yeah, John's like, come on over, but you got to be here in about three minutes because I'm leaving. <laughs> <clears throat> okay, let me try Reddit and see if there's anything new on the sausage. They talk about sausage on Reddit. They talk about everything on Reddit. Oh, yeah. Yeah, there's a... <laughs> they talk about everything on Reddit. <laughs> They're having fun in chat. Talking about a sausage sausage. <laughs> <laughs> there's a new idea. Well, there's a, there's sausage talk. There's there's a barbecue. <clears throat> Smoked jalapeno cheddar. We do that. I've seen this one a number of times. So what do you guys think about a smoked cranberry, orange, and sage? Hmm. Pork sausage. Although you could do that with chicken, too. The one guy just recommended Vidalia onion and dried cranberry chicken sausage. Said it's delicious. Yeah, it Very sounds nice. good. Oh, look at that. Chicken with saffron and apricot. Oh, there you go. I mean, saffron's super expensive, but, really you don't, expensive. but you don't need much of it. No. And then are people going to be okay with a yellow sausage? I don't know. Pineapple macadamia nut with wild boar. We don't do wild game, unfortunately. The problem with wild game is it has to be harvested in a USDA inspected facility before coming to us. Chicken pesto sausage. People got to be ready to eat green sausage. Yeah. Well, one time I attempted to make this at the plant, I made green sausage. <laughs> I, think, I think sometimes, hey, they do this to me on purpose. They put stuff in here for me to try to pronounce it. 
You know how well I do with pronouncing stuff. Is it Harissa? Mm hmm. I got that one. Yeah. I'm going to give myself a pat on the back. You did. Harissa and Apricot. <laughs> They're saying maybe put it in the refrigerator and let it cool down and see what the mouth feel is. And like to focus when I'm way back there. All right, y'all, it's been three hours. This has been fun. We did get the smoker going, and we did officially smoke something on the food boat 2.0. Thank God we're back in action. Um, I think right now I'm just going to wrap it up here and uh, get some stuff done. Keating is coming. Keating, there's going to be plenty of food for you when you get here. But, um, but yeah, we're just going to go ahead and uh, and shut the stream down here three hours into it. Thanks y'all for hanging out with us on a Saturday. Thanks to Haig for coming and hanging out. And thanks to uh, Joe Keating for coming and getting the freaking smoker working. Um, I will see y'all later. I might hop back on here later today. Uh, we'll see. I mean, I'll be spending the time out of the boat, so I might hop on here. Um, y'all have a great day. Thanks again and see you next time.